The Valuing Nature programme is creating data sets from across the whole range of different academic disciplines. So we have data sets from the natural environment, we have data sets from the economic and social sciences, from medical research and from the arts and humanities. The real challenge there is to think about how to use those data sets together and even to create metadata that can describe those data sets in a standardised way. The focus for the programme has been on making sure that the research projects all have really good data management plans and we've been able to provide support from the data centre, both the Environmental Information Data Centre and also the UK Data Archive to make sure that we have expertise both from the environmental side and from the social science side. And we've worked quite hard with those programmes to make sure that they do have good data management plans in place to think about how we're going to make sure that data is safe in future, how is it going to be accessed, how is it going to be shared. So the challenge is, when you're doing your research and you're very focused on the science you want to deliver, the research you want to carry out, the practical steps, the field work, the challenge is to also make time to think about the data management. And that's really in your own interest as well as thinking about the long-term value of the data that you're collecting. So it's when your laptop battery dies to make sure that you don't lose all of your data. It's when you look back in six months' time at that, that important field work that you collected to make sure that you remember what units you used or what method you took in collecting the data. And it's to make sure that at the end of your work, that data is secure, that it can be reused, it's well described, and that other people can use it as well as yourself down the line. And that way you actually get the credit for all the hard work that you've put in to collecting that data.